And welcome back here tonight at 5 o'clock, and hopefully you'll get downtown tonight because the My Waterloo Days Parade will be kicking off in just about an hour or so from now. Residents and visitors already gathering downtown to celebrate one of the iconic community events of the entire year. So with that in mind, let's go live right now to KWWO's Lily Cedardall. Lily joins us live from the parade route. So let's talk about what's happening where you are because this will always attract a large crowd. Lily, tell us more. Ron, excitement is in the air for the 42nd annual My Waterloo Days celebration. In fact, there's over 100 parade participants in this year's parade. Let, let me let me go ahead and show you exactly what the scenes are looking like right now. Folks behind me here already preparing for a fun-filled evening. Experience Waterloo and the city say they are preparing for some of the largest crowds yet. Last year, over 23,000 people visited downtown Waterloo for the My Waterloo Days festivities. However, given this year's well-known headliners, Mayor Qu Quentin Hart anticipates even more traction this year. Over the last couple of years, uh, more investment by um, sponsors, which really helped. Um, stepping up with, um, you know, more... Uh, nationally recognized talent and incredible inclusion across all parts of our community. And so it's really an incredible celebration that seems to keep growing and growing. Now, for those of you wondering where to park, you can do so at any of the three parking ramps on your screen. Entrances for Lincoln Park can be found at Franklin and Park or 4th and Mulberry. The most popular spot to watch the parade will be at 4th and Mulberry. And in order to maintain a safe and secure environment this year, they are changing the bag policy just a little bit. They are preferring clear bags be brought into this event or you can bring in some gallon bags, whatever you prefer, of course. In our next half hour, I will talk to you a little bit more about the parade route as it takes off, as well as that economic impact that we'll see this weekend. Live in Waterloo, Lily Cedar Dawn, News 7, KWL. All right, Lily, have a great time down there tonight.